Well, I'm just finishing up this system here. Uh, this is a 240-130 combi. Um, the customer had some space constraints as well of a sort of unique um, setup where their heating zone pipes came over on a wall from the left here, uh, bent around a chimney, and they were really limited on the amount of space. There was actually a wall that's going to be going up right here. So um, they had basically about three feet exactly to work with. So this thing is 36 inches. So I was able to really get this thing fitted tightly in here. And I did that by... Um, sort of turning up these circulators uh, towards the front of the boiler. Um, really happy with how this came out. A uh, little bit of a challenge, uh, nothing I wasn't able to do, but just sort of figuring out everything to get it really uh, tucked in here as compact as possible, but also being able to service it if need be. If you needed to change a circulator out um, or anything like that, I wanted to make it really easy to do. So, um, you know, if you had to do some work on the piping, it would obviously, you know, obviously be a little bit difficult. But again, changing a pump on or anything like that or redoing some wiring, none of that would obviously need to really happen. Usually the most is maybe in a bunch of years, you got to replace a circulator if you had trouble with it. But um, we went ahead and installed a NaviClean on here as well. Uh, these are really great. Um, and the air eliminator is basically just tucked back behind that since that's not really a serviceable part. Uh, the expansion tank will hang right off the bottom of that. Um, he's got plenty of room on the bottom to be able to mount that. So, um, yeah, this was a fun one to do. Uh, he's probably picking it up next week, and we're just going to keep moving on to the next one. So if you guys uh, haven't yet, subscribe to the channel. We have tons of videos on different builds, um, going over all different parts of how boiler systems work and whatnot. Uh, if you want me to build you a system, or if you want some consulting on building your own system, or if you just have general questions, uh, also reach out. I'll put my information in the description and uh, give this video a thumbs up if you can and subscribe if you haven't yet and we'll see you guys on the next one.